What's up guys and welcome back to another epic exciting video another unpacking of the 25th anniversary packs of Pokemon that came out earlier this year I want to say late January time frame I can't remember exactly when but we got some more of these even though we got the highly sought after holographic Pikachu there's still one card that eludes us and that is the holographic Charmander which is why we got some more of these packs and of course today's video is brought to you by my local McDonald's place here in Las Vegas obviously they're great people and of course they definitely hooked it up and of course we got a bunch of chicken nuggets and we ate a lot of them <laughs> so of course obviously let's get into the unpacking of some more of these 25th anniversary packs in this video of course we have our buddy liam man welcome back into the stream what's up guys glad to be here especially for this 25th un unpacking and this nostalgia trip just keeps coming it's oh nice. yes oh yes um i guess as a status like were you able to pick any of these up in where you are in the uk N did not even get a look in not any way shape remotely or form yeah so you, you don't think you guys have it at all uh i honestly don't think we had that over here part of the uh debacle the debauchery of uh, what happened with the uh, scalping scenario kind of put a bit of a downer on the distribution if you guys recall when these things did come out people were scalping and like liam was saying and it was even harder to find these things people were in line getting like not just one but like a bunch of like happy meals and like by the time like kids come out from from school and want to buy a happy meal they can't because they're all gone like that same day of course there's still people online that are scalping them and selling it for a pretty hefty price so definitely watch where you shop and be careful out there because people will of course jip you and what's crazy is like even certain like card shops are selling these for like at least five dollars so if you guys go to like a local card shop they actually might have it at a pretty affordable price if you just want to buy it individually and not the meal associated with it. So definitely check out your local car shop. And of course, they also need your help as well, especially during these hard times during the pandemic. But um, nevertheless, guys, what is your chase card, Liam? My chase card has to be the iconic Pikachu. Again, you want another Pikachu? Of course, if you do get a second Pikachu, we'll probably add it into the collective domain store. So definitely check it out. A collective domain store link down below if you guys are interested in any of the cards that we have in store. We also have sealed product as well from Ghost from the Past as well as other stuff from like the Legend of Season 2 and even Genesis Impact and Phantom Rage if you guys want to check out some of the other sealed products in the collective domain but enough rambling and self-promotion let's jump into some of the unpacking of these things can we get our charmander can we get another pikachu let's find out all right guys here it is the packs obviously we're going to take it out of these containers and lay it out and we have a good luck charm here to pikachu for some more pikachu pulls and maybe even a charmander pull so let's go and uh, unwrap it. If you guys want to check out what's actually inside of these, obviously, you know, everything is pretty much um, laid out like this, but we have a full video where we did an actual unboxing of everything that's inside. Definitely check it out. We have a little annotation over here. Definitely let, take a look at that if you guys want to watch it. It's attached to a live stream, but does have the 25th anniversary pack in everything of that video. You could probably make a nice poster with all the uh, leftover boxes. You pretty good. You really could. All right, guys. These are the packs. Wish us luck. Now, what I like about these is that they have all the rares at the very, very front. So what we're going to do is kind of we'll surprise ourselves a little bit and uh, keep the uh, the rare in the very back. I think that's how it should be. You know what I mean? We should always keep the, the the most rare card in the back. Yeah, and no codes for this one, unfortunately, guys. Yep, no codes. All right. <gasps> okay, we got the uh, <laughs> first card, but of course, this is not the this is the non hollow version, but it's still nostalgic for me. Joseph Charmander. We have a uh, Sobble. Totodile. I think there's a new card for the collection, and. The hollow Totodial. Nice. Very nice. I think this is actually new to the collection, so that's very, very cool. But I'm very happy with this Charmander. If, the, if this is all the Charmander we get, I'll be happy. But at the same time, look at Charmander. He's definitely not happy. The most saddest Charmander promo card for kids in a Happy Meals. 
What is that? <laughs> hey, I'm just at saying. Least uh, at least it wasn't a sad to the cobra, you know? But that total dial is at the price of $4.23. The hollow version, right? Yeah. It's definitely sleeve worthy. Now, these things are definitely retaining their valleys, which is very, very good to know. All right, next pack. Try not to look at the card. All right. We have uh, Frosky. Is that how you pronounce it? Froki? Froki. Someone complained in one of the videos that never, never try to touch the actual face of the card, like the actual design of it. If you try, if, if you want to like, I like guess sleeve it up, make sure you touch like the anti or, you know, against the, uh, More uh, like cardboard. yeah, you don't want to ruin the actual image. So we have to pig, T pig, yeah. roulette and Ooh, a holographic. Oh. Cyndaquil. This is actually new for the collection as well. Hi, it's at a very neat price of uh, $4.20. Very nice. Very curious to see what these prices will be like during like, um, I don't know, five years from now, 10 years from now. I wonder if they will actually appreciate in value. Well, uh, you never know that uh, five years down the line and, and a video recommendation might just uh, do a catch up once that comes around. Yeah, oh yeah, we can do a follow up video. That's a good point, very good point. All right. We have um, Piblock, another Cinequil, but the non hollow version. Litten, and a holographic uh, Chikorita. Uh, Chikorita is still at the sleepable price of uh, $2.65. Mm, okay. I don't remember if we, have, if we got this one already. All right, next pack. Okay. We have Grookey. Chikorita, Roulette, and a holographic Grookey. It is still very speed worthy, $3.21. Very nice. Yeah, as I was saying before, if you guys for some reason can't find this in your local McDonald's and or if you don't want to buy the food associated with it, definitely check out your local card shop because I was actually surprised that um, my, my shop had it. So, and for it supports the local community as well. Alright, next pack. Oops, wrong way. Oh, there's the Pikachu, but the non hollow version. Out of curiosity, how much is the non hollow Pikachu worth? Non hollow Pikachu is currently at the price of <laughs> $2.16. For a non hollow? For a non hollow normal. Wow. Okay, we'll sleep that later, I guess. <laughs> All right, T Pig. Ooh, I, this is new. I never saw this before. A uh, Turk wig, and a holographic Scorch Bunny. So still sleeve worthy. Two dollars and fifty three cents. I'm very very surprised on this Pikachu though. <laughs> <laughs> that is the power of Pikachu, guys. The power of Pikachu. You took the words right out of my mind. I was just thinking those words. They're printing on the power of Pikachu. Mm -hmm. All right. Next pack. Try my best not to look at the cards. The one thing I will say about these packs, they're they're very cheaply made. So, but uh, that's besides the point. They kind of look like they were partly uh, cardboardy. Yeah, they're like super thick. Um, like, well, I guess when you compare it to like a Shining Faith or a Blazing Vortex, obviously the materials are totally different, but this one's like, it just feels like a cheap, hard, like almost pa almost papery feel, uh, like cardboard, uh, like construction paper feel almost. Ooh, another Charmander. Out of curiosity, how much is a um, non-hollow Charmander worth? Charmander is currently at the price of... One dollar and two cents. Wow, still sleeve worthy though. All right. So we have another Cyndaquil, a Scorch Bunny, and ooh, a Fendikin Hollow. Is that a new one to our account? I believe we might have got this already. Obviously, we'll have the the counter in the bottom left uh, for the, our collector's counter, but I believe we don't got this one. 
I believe we don't got uh, that's not the proper English. <laughs> it's uh, still a very sleeve worthy two dollars and seventeen cents. Correct. I believe we don't got those are like grammar majors or anything like that. They're probably cringing right now. Okay. So let's put this over here. Okay. Next pack. Alright. We have Grookey. Chikorita. Another tug wig. And. <gasps> another no hollow Pikachu! Oh my god, how much is it worth now? Bravo, my friend, that's a nice $38.57. Very nice. Now keep in mind, like, when this first came out, it was probably like right around the $45, $50 range. So it has depreciated a bit, but as soon as no more of these packs are available, which there's still a few out there lingering around, once there's no more packs out there and they're all broken, these things will definitely start appreciating up in value. So definitely, definitely be a, be a lookout for these Pikachus. Yeah, it kind of makes you think how much the uh, unopened packet might be once the giveaway goes away for after a few years. That's a good point. That's a good point. All right, so we'll add it there. Okay. Pikachu, not so lonely no more. Mm -hmm. It's almost like a shiny Pikachu. All right, next pack. We're still looking for that Charmander, guys. Hollow Charban is all that I asked for. All right, another Charmander, the regular non-hollow. It's like he's like teasing me. We have T Pig, Totodile, and another Grookey Hollow. Yeah, you know, can't turn the nose up at three dollars and twenty-one. You know exactly. All right, next pack. We still got, including this one, we have four more left, guys. Press the like for luck for my Charmander. <laughs> I just went Charmander Hollow. All right, ooh, Bulbasaur would be good Hollow as well. Uh, fin uh, Finnekin, a Mudkip, and another <laughs> Pikachu. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that's in that's insane, guys. Two hollow Pikachus. Damn. All right. <laughs> Next pack. I mean, we're, we're 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 like sitting pretty right now with two Pikachus, so we definitely made our money's worth already. Um, but at the same time, like, uh, where's that Charmander? Where's that Charmander, guys? How about that third Pikachu? Well, technically two hollow Pikachus, but yeah. All right, we have the uh, Piplook Squirtle. I think we got this already hollow, so it's pretty good. Scorch Bunny and a Fendikin again, hollow. But yeah, guys, two hollow Pikachus. All right, two packs left. A lot more. That could buy you a lot of Happy Meal. Mm-hmm. Now what I've learned also is that uh, Yuki also... Ha uh, what I also learned as well is that Yuki also has like... Anniversary packs in uh, McDonald's. So if, if, there's, if those ever come out, we'll definitely try to uh, get those for you guys. Uh, Grookey. Chikorita. Uh, Chimchar. And... A hollow... P uh, peep -lup. Tiny little penguin dude. It's very cute. Very cute. And a very sweet $2.57. Very nice. Definitely sleep worthy. Alright guys, oh my god, down to the last pack. Charmander has, has eluded us. But let's see, last pack. Press a like for luck. Especially if you want to see a Charmander. We have three... Charmander is a non hollow, but it's not good enough for the collective. Alright, here we go. Piplup, Chikorita, uh, Turkwig, and a hollow Totodile, a second one, actually. Oh, man. Well, it was still a decent ending, my friend, at $3.85. 
Very nice. I mean, I kind of jinxed myself a little bit when I mentioned if all I get is Charmanders, non hollow, I'll be happy. And I guess I should be happy, but I don't feel very happy. <laughs> well, regardless, guys. But I, I feel happy because I called the Pikachu. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Two of them, in fact. Two of them. So this is definitely a pulling for. Uh, it's definitely a pulling for Liam. This is the final total for all the cards to include all the comments that we pulled for today's video. We definitely made our monies back. All right, guys, that pretty concludes it. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed that 25th anniversary unpacking of the Pokemon sets from McDonald's. Of course, we pulled some pretty epic cards. Obviously, the highlights, of course, it's got to be the Pikachu yet again. We were still hoping for a Charmander, but it eludes us yet again. We do have the non hollow Charmander, three of them, in fact. But of course, like I mentioned before, if, if, if that's all we get, I'll try to be happy about it. So I'll try to be humble that we pulled three Charmanders and of course two of the epic Pikachus and of course they'll probably add it into our collective domain store definitely check that out link down below if you guys are interested in purchasing some cards but of course if you guys want to join the collective as well definitely click on that join button it definitely helps support the show as well you, you get exclusive perks and of course discounts from the collective domain store so definitely check it out if you guys are interested in that and of course it also helps if you guys want to watch our recording session live streams as well as a member of the collective but of course don't worry you don't have to be a member to watch the live streams those live streams eventually will be added to an unlisted playlist but it's for those that want to help support the show even further and go above and beyond and speaking of pokemon later in the week we will be doing the new pokemon snap of course a live stream free of course you don't have to be a member of that to watch it and of course we'll have a little competition going on with myself and liam similar to our last live stream of the pokemon snap from the n64 days and that of course will be pretty dang epic so definitely subscribe if you haven't done so i will definitely see you in the live stream and of course future videos here in the collective domain but that's all i got until next time this is talos and liam signing out peace